Hey, hey, gang, and my radar meteorologist, Matt Capucci. You know, if you think forecasting weather is tough, try predicting snow that isn't coming from storm clouds. Instead, meteorologists occasionally have to predict snow from man-made objects. Here we count down the top five weirdest things to produce snow. Number five, commercial airplanes. On February 12, 2021, residents in Dallas-Fort Worth Metroplex saw a snow flurry south of the DFW International Airport. The flurries were falling just south of the north-south runway. Here's a shot showing them on radar. Now let's look at weather balloon data to figure out exactly what was going on. The line on the left is dew point and on the right that's temperature. We can see a layer of below freezing saturated air a few thousand feet above the ground with sub-freezing temperatures at the surface. There were likely super cooled water droplets or water in small droplets present below freezing in the layer the planes passed through while landing. Aerosols from plane engines acted as something for them to freeze onto, creating snowflakes. That same air mass was the start of an extreme winter event that brought the coldest air since 1989 to the Lone Star State. All of Texas was under a winter storm warning at one point, and the state's power grid became crippled under the increased demand. Believe it or not, airplane effect snow has happened before. The exact same thing occurred in the loop-like landing pattern east of Chicago's O'Hare International Airport on November 27, 2018. Here's a flight plan from that day. Number four, slaughterhouses. On January 19, 2011, exhaust from a smokestack in Dodge City, Kansas, combined with steam from two slaughterhouses. That dropped up to 0.7 inches of snowfall. Now, to get that to happen, it has to be very cold, but the prevailing wind direction was especially unusual, coming out of the east-southeast, but somehow being cold enough for that snow. Here you can see a satellite shot that captures that stripe of snow after it came down. It left a patch of white that appeared the same shade as clouds on the color scale. Number three, sound effects snow. No, this is not snow that makes sound. Instead, it's like lake effect snow, but much more localized. It happened on January 14, 2016, east of Long Island Sound, and also off the coast of the Outer Banks of the Carolinas on December 31st, 2017. Number two, tiny lakes. On February 21st, 2020, a small plume of lake effect snow formed just south of Lake Lanier near Atlanta, Georgia, believe it or not. Models had even simulated this in advance as evidence from this high resolution model image. Aiding in the snow was very cold air training south and converging from the north and from the east of the Appalachians that produced sufficient lift to yield snow showers. And number one, the strangest of all, humans. Under extremely rare circumstances, humans can produce their own snowfall. That requires the ingredients for ice fog. Ice fog occurs when you have saturated air at temperatures too low for super cold water droplets to survive. We're talking like minus 40 or colder. That can sometimes occur in places like Alaska. Any addition of moisture to the air, perhaps from your vehicle exhaust or even your breath, will turn into ice crystals. Now, odds are you wouldn't want to be outside for long, but if you were, you could produce your own snowflakes. Follow My Radar on social media, Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, and YouTube. Download My Radar on iOS, Android, Amazon Alexa, Xbox, and Windows.